Hello again, gals! The Welsh Hunter here, back with yet another mega fantastical title update for Cruise Brothers. Now, whether you like it or not, the first ever, I'm pretty sure, game to hit 6,000 game score is here, and I'd say it's here for good. And yet again, it is another easy enough title update worth another 1,000 Gs. S. And remember, the game only costs $7.99, so if you're yet to play it, now's as good a time as any. So in this title update, we only need to play as five different characters, doing what's called a breaker and a super, basically a defensive and offensive mega mover. Bang. All in all, this should only take around 10 to 15 minutes, maybe a bit less. So with that being said then, let's do it. As always. So of course, it's been a while since this title update came about, but once we are at the main menu here, what we're going to do is scroll all the way to the left and go to Brawl Knight. And we're going to pick O'Brien. O'Brien is going to be our little um, biz snatch, as it were. Of course, you can't swear now because YouTube will demonetize you for even uttering it. Uh, choose the first fighter here, Marcus Lutz. Lutz, Lutz, baby. Doom, 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 doom. Guy with the big American flag tattooed. Uh, you deserve a beatdown if you got an American flag tattooed. Any country on anywhere uh, tattooed on you. you nah, it's, it's just no good. Anyway, what are you going to do then? Now, what I actually found easier, what was it? I end up um, just getting myself a little hurt because um, we, we're going to do the breakers first. So basically what the breaker is, is you see in the, the bottom left hand corner where the heart's just gone up. When that, turn, when that heart uh, turns into a crown, when you can now press the left bumper and right bumper at the same time when you're about to be hit. And that will get you the breaker move. Uh, now, of course, the way you get that is by hitting your opponent. So the X and B button is obviously big hits, and the A button is just jabs. Now, my... And then when we do the crown again, press the left trigger to do a super. So it's exactly the same thing. So that's all you're going to be looking at is the bottom left-hand corner. As soon as the crown becomes available, you're going to be pressing the left trigger for a mega super offensive attack. And then you're going to be pressing the left bumper and right bumper at the same time for a defensive breaker attack when your enemy is about when the uh, enemy is about to hit you so again big o'brien here um second fighter anyway we're going to do this with is felipe cruz lutz cruz baby and it's just going to be the same thing but like i said like the first the first guy i used there marcus i was pressing the x button and b button i was beating him down a little bit too quickly but with the a button what you're going to see is if you just keep spamming the a button here you're going to see that the uh, bottom left hand corner that the, the uh, gauge if you will will go up a lot quicker and your opponent's HP won't go down nearly as quick so uh, yeah, so it's just a lot easier to do this just keep jabbing keep jabbing again make sure that you get hurt to do a breaker as soon as the crown uh, is available all right well I just got my ass kicked right there then just do the breaker again left bumper right bumper as soon as he's about to hit you and then just keep doing the same thing. So just keep spamming the A button to jab, jab, jab. That'll make the HP go down slowly, which we want. And the um, gauge on the left. Left trigger again to use your super. So the gauge on the left will go up a lot quicker as well. Plus you get a bunch of combos as well, which is nice. So that's already uh, two out of the five fighters that we need in order to do this. So as soon as we get the round two, start -o. Then we can press the pause button, go down to the main menu. We don't ha we don't need to continue with the fight. And then that's what you're going to do. So you're just going to keep going to Brawl Night. So again, it's a very easy title update. Um, O'Brien, I'm sorry, you're going to get your ass kicked again. Ego Cruise this time is what we need to do. And then you just keep doing the same thing. So you just keep hitting the A button, keep tapping. Of course, like I said before, your opponent's HP goes down slow, which is what we want. Your gauge goes up quick. And then as soon as you get the crown, as soon as you see the crown, and your gauge meter is all freedom over eagles per miles per second. Sorry, just thought I'd use an American metric system, but of course it's the imperial system the Americans use. So, uh, well, you know, close enough. Eagles over the football fields per millimeter. Uh, <laughs> I'm just joking, Americans. I love you. So, again, remember, left bumper, right bumper at the same time to do the breaker. Then you do the same thing, spam the A button. And eventually, and, and hey, us Brits have got stuff wrong with us too. So it's all it's always fun to take the to take the absolute mick out of each other, isn't it? And there we go for the super. So that's already three out of five. 
Because for some reason, the Americans seem to have a problem with British people eating beans on toast. That is the ultimate, the ultimate snack joy. Okay? You haven't had beans, especially cheesy beans on toast as well. That's, that's an epic one too. And especially if you put some sausage and egg and hash browns and everything with it. It's just, oh, it just makes it even better. So we've got two more fighters, which we need to do. Sorry, I was going off a bit there. Starting to get a bit of Homer Simpson. Go over to the fourth fighter, for Claudio Colo. Colo. He literally looks like a Malteser. Uh, nice, nice shiny bald head. I'm actually with him on that one. I look one of the look like one of those Maltesers with the little bit of hair sticking out. You know, one of the Maltesers that you find underneath the settee for a while. Yeah, that's that's my haircut. How how beautiful am I? So again, you're going to do the same thing, even with Claudio. Spam the A button again as usual. And then when the crown appears, left bumper, right bumper, as soon as you don't, assume you don't get uppercutted for the next breaker. And at the minute, it's all rare achievements as well, which is just delightful. So smash, again, obviously do the same thing. And again, this is just an easier one, because we only have to do it with five fighters, which is just nice. So you can just do it in the one fight, rather than having to do 10 or 12 separate fights. Left trigger again, bam, job done, and then we only have one fighter left, and that is Gabriel Ribeiro, the Ribeiro sandwich. Red corner wins. Round two, fight! And here we are then, for the last time. Go down, he'll be at the bottom row left side. Gabriel Rib Sandwich, there he is. Oh, the McRibwidge. Oh man, especially like the ones off the Simpsons. Was it only America that got the Ribwidge? The Rib, the McRib Sandwich? Because I don't, I'm sure Britain doesn't have it. And I want my arteries clogged with McSandwich Ribness. Uh, but anyway, again, obviously, as we've uh, said, we're going to be doing the same thing. Um, our fighter looking more like a Murray from the uh, Impractical Jokers, uh, more than Gabriel Ribeiro himself. There we go, left bumper, right bumper to breaker. And then, of course, for the final time, we will be doing the same thing. And then pressing the left trigger to attack old America. Flub, yeah. Coming again to save the mother day, yeah. And there it is then. Blink of an eye. All the achievements are done. And that should be yours in about 10 to 15 minutes. So, there we go. If we have a little look now, you should be on 64. Well, depending, you've done all the games so far. 64 to 64. 6,000 out of 6,000. Incredible. So, there we go. Thank you so, so much for watching, guys and gals. I hope you've enjoyed this next title update. And that the guides helped as well. If it is, if it does, of course, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Share with a friend as well. Big shout out to all my Patreon supporters, as always. Big love, homies and homesses. And I'll see you in the next one. Big love. Why did I just do that in the tuna pepper? Yeah.